Well, howdy there, Internet people. It's Bo again. So today we are going to talk about the governor of South Dakota, a book, and some claimed inconsistencies. Um, and we'll just kind of go through what is being said and see if we can maybe spot a trend that might shed some light on some things. If you have missed the news, the governor of South Dakota, Christy Noem, has a book coming out soon. And it has already uh, created a situation with some slight controversy regarding a story involving a puppy. Beyond that, there are now questions being raised about the depiction of certain events. One of them, I remember when I met with the North Korean dictator Kim Jong-un I'm sure he underestimated me, having no clue about my experience staring down little tyrants. I've been a children's pastor, after all. Um, there's this one. I think there's one involving Nikki Haley, and then another involving uh, France. These stories are being called into question as to whether or not they occurred in the way that she's suggesting, or in some cases at all. Now, this is something that can actually occur if a ghostwriter is used, and notes are made, or they're using references. Things like this happen. And it is worth noting that at this point, the book still isn't really released. These are advanced copies. Um, We'll see what her team has to say about some of the, the questions that are being raised. But there is an interesting trend, right? All of these uh, events, they all deal with foreign policy. They all deal with international affairs. If someone was writing a book... And the goal of that book was to convince another person um, who, you know, read it between naps to maybe make them his vice president. Having stories related to international affairs would be an important part of it. Uh, again... It's early, and if she had help writing the book, maybe that's what occurred. Um, we'll have to wait and see. But the trend that exists and the knowledge that she certainly was uh, gunning for Trump's approval, it, it, there might be more to it. Again, we have to wait. But... At this point, it seems like the book might have been better off if there were more dogs and less people in it. And given the reaction to the book, the stories that are contained in it, I would suggest her chances of being Trump's VP are probably somewhere in a gravel pit. Anyway, it's just a thought. Y'all have a good day.